What is up all of you awesome and amazing people on YouTube? The Old Coot here coming at you with another exciting video. Wonder Cow Colostrum. That's what this is. Basically restore and revitalize. I love their packaging. Their packaging is amazing because it actually shows you what this product does right on the front. No mistaking anything for anything. But basically you get it straight from the company. Immune support, GI tract health, right? Muscle recovery, and revitalized energy. What this basically is, is after the mom cow has a baby cow, there's a window of opportunity for the mom cow to impart or bestow on the calf, right? The baby cow, as much nutrients and, and basically cow building elements and nutrients and minerals and vitamins and other stuff as possible right after birth. So the mother's milk basically contains the most nutrients that that baby cow or calf would need during its initial like first week or month of growing, right? So anyways, what is what do I use this for? <laughs> basically, I'm trying to get just that little that little little edge on bodybuilding, muscle recovery, muscle building, protein synthesis as possible. And dairy, ironically, was a huge part of the 1970s golden era bodybuilders kind of nutrient supplement routine, like part of their diet, if that's what you want to call it. Even bronze era or silver era, you kind of get the idea. Milk and eggs were like their two main go-tos when it came to like muscle building stuff you know if that's what you want to call it at least within their diet so this is basically just basically amped up milk is basically what it's concentrated down to what this is is basically it's a powdered or dehydrated version of that mother's milk and the way the way that most companies do this or get this is what they'll do is they'll take that milk right after the calf is born. So they'll take the mother's milk, they'll milk the cow. What they do is they spray it in like a, 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 a controlled dehydration chamber that basically that sprayed milk turns into a powder form, right? It basically is dehydrated. And then what ends up happening is, is they cool it down and they kind of, you know, mix it around. And basically that's what you get here. So the serving size is pretty tiny right? You don't need a whole lot of it, just enough. Uh, let's look at the back label so you can kind of get an idea what's going on there. So two scoops is one serving. You get 60 servings per container. There's your supplemental facts. If you want to go ahead and take a look at that screenshot, that all, all you get the idea. But it's bovine colostrum, right? 40% IgG. You get that amino, amino, immunoglobulins, if I can pronounce that correctly. I'm having focus, focus issues. But anyways, uh, I do like the fact that, you know, you get there. There's your suggested serving size and all that stuff. I do like the fact that it's made in the USA, third party tested, which is amazing. Third party testing means that there's a there's a testing process of someone that has nothing to do with the company that goes in and tests this to make sure that what's in here and what they're saying is in here is correct and true and that you're getting basically what is described in the labels and all that other good stuff. So anyways, you have uh, no additives, which is great, which means it's 100% pure colostrum, so you get the idea. And then if we look on the other side, backside of water, here you go, Live Wonderfully. This is a quick spiel about their company, manufactured, you get the idea, Madera, California. I believe Madera is up north somewhere, <laughs> right, in Northern California. And uh, a, another fun fact for you, if you're traveling on the 5 freeway, Interstate 5, Basically, when you come around, I think it's the San Luis Obispo area, you pass a place called Harris Ranch, which is a ton of cows. I mean, like tons of cows that are being uh, basically living there happily on a farm and being used for <laughs> being used for milk processing and also for meat. Anyways, you get the idea. So because what happens to the female cows, right? They stay female, but the male cows, they turn into our steaks and hamburgers and everything else. Anyways, you get the idea. So with that being said, here's the product. Way The way that I take this or the way that I would suggest taking this is Go ahead and make a shake out of it, right? And make, you know, knock yourself out. If you want to break out the blender and make like a, you know, fruit smoothie and then throw two scoops of this in there, totally cool. If you're at the gym, like let's say I'm at the gym and I'm doing my post-workout protein shake, 
What I'll do is I'll mix this in with the protein powder like ahead of time, whatever protein powder I'm using that week or month or year or whatever. Uh, so basically it's getting a little, er, just a little extra kick to my protein shake. Another way that I could use this is, uh, as mentioned earlier, was coconut water, right? Throw in some frozen fruit like the mango, strawberry, banana, you know, whatever kind of whatever floats your boat. Or you could do even like a green smoothie like kale, apple, green apple, you know, whatever you want to throw in there, carrots, whatever. You can kind of do that vibe and just throw two scoops in. That's how I would do it. You can do it straight if you want to go ahead and do that. If you want to just mix two scoops in with some water, like that's what they're saying here, right? It says uh, you could either do it with eight ounces of water, you could do it with a smoothie, or you could do it with your favorite beverage. So you kind of get the idea. It does mix up pretty well, right? It is pretty uh, easily dissolved in water. So there's not a whole lot of like clumpiness or any of that kind of stuff. Note that if you do this on its own, it does foam up a little bit, right? So if you're using this in conjunction with, let's say like, what is it like uh, potassium, you know, or carbonate or what is it? Potassium carbonate. You might get a premature explosion out of your, <laughs> out of your shaker mixer. So just keep that in mind because this does bubble up a little bit. So keep that in mind. So leave room. What I'm trying to say is leave room. When you fill up your water and you fill up your ingredients, leave room in your shaker to allow for the expansion of gases in there that will kind of expand and then release, you know, pop the lid off, release the, the gases and then go ahead and drink it. But anyways, pretty smooth. Like I said, this, this just gives, in my case, my specific case, this just gives me that just a little extra kick, a little extra optimization of my nutrient absorption, right? Because I'm trying to build muscle, burn body fat. That's the whole goal. Anyways, if you do like what you're seeing, I will put a link to this down below in the description. So make sure to check that out. Also, make sure to hit that like button, hit the subscribe button down there below. And I will catch you all on the next exciting video. Great stuff. Really great stuff. And I, like I said, I love their marketing and their packaging.